of Jesus. Yeah, my sister forgot to, to record the, the video. Amen. And I was telling you, the man invited Jesus to come to his house. And that man said to Jesus, Lord, I'm not worthy of you. Yes, it's a sign of humility. It's a sign of humility. But it's also because of the tradition. Because in the tradition, the, the Jew is not allowed to go to the known to the chanted place. And when the other Jew would see him, there may be glory or there may be criticizing. Or when the Pharisee would see him, there may be criticizing. And he said, Lord, I'm not worthy of you. But just say a word. God doesn't look to your position. God 
will not look to your social apartments. God will not look to your work. God will not look with your with, with whatever is it that you can mind about it. Just what I'm telling you today is just for you to have faith. Just have faith. Just have a plan of faith. That when you live here, the situation will be like before. Amen. Amen. I'm here. Before we let us see our visitor today. I'm here to tell you, brother and sister, just have faith. Last Sunday we said that people should come, everyone will be a disciple, we need to go to evangelize, but even we said that we will come again this. But I'm telling you all today, just have faith. Maybe when you come here last Sunday and you pray for a brother, and once you pray for that brother, that situation was even less. But because you come to the church and pray, and you feel that the, the thing is not taking another level, maybe complicated. I'm just telling you to pray for this service. Just our faith. The thing people have said that thing will not work. As it was not working before. I'm just telling you to pray. Whatever I say, whatever it matters, it, whatever the person that you pray for is it, whatever the person that I'm the product that you think about the person is it, whatever the situation is it, just have faith. And if you have faith for that, I like that soldier, you will see the glory of the Lord this morning. May the Lord bless every one of you. Jesus name.